Hey guys, welcome back to another video and happy 2020! one for new year's resolution type of deals i don't really see the point of it but this year i thought i'd go ahead and give myself the little resolution of getting more comfortable and being a little more myself when it comes to filming because i'm very like you know to myself so when it comes to like filming around my family or in public i tend to like get very like about it so one resolution that I decided to put out for this year is to get out there, be myself, and not really care about vlogging in public and all that because I want to put my all into this video or videos for you guys because as you guys know, I really like to make these videos for you. I love having my YouTube channel and I love just, you know, filming, editing, and I can't really make that happen if I'm not being myself 100% basically. So yeah, I'm gonna try to be more confident this year. I'm gonna try to not be so in my shell but we'll see how it goes so give this video a thumbs up right now if you guys are ready to finally see me be myself and not give a care in the world because I am just gotta work on it <laughs> so today I thought I'd go ahead and start off 2020 with a vlog for you guys I didn't really do a New Year's vlog because I worked that day and then by the time I was out and then heading to family's house I was already kind of tired so didn't really I, didn't, I wasn't up for filming so I'm gonna go ahead and film today for you guys I have some things that I want to do today so I thought I'd just go ahead and film it and have you guys do these things with me so last night when I got home from work I told my mom that today I wanted to do a little makeup shopping because there are times when I do makeup videos for you guys and I really don't want to keep bugging Debbie for her makeup so I want to go ahead and probably stop at Ulta to just buy a few little makeup up things for myself so whenever those videos come out or whenever I have to do my makeup for an occasion or whatever I have my own stuff so I don't really need to buy brushes because as you guys know I got these makeup brushes by Debbie for Christmas so that's basically set what I do need is basically everything else for the face. I was gonna list it, but we already know what's for the face. So I need stuff like that, and I wanna buy a few eyeshadow palettes as well, so hopefully that happens today. I wanna go and get my bangs trimmed because they're getting long, as you guys can tell. I had to like swipe them to the side so they wouldn't get all up in my face. So I wanna see if I can do that today. Kinda have to buy a few things necessities um but we'll see how that goes because i got paid today and most of my money went to this new camera that i bought from canon so we're gonna see how we do it hopefully we can i might have to not do one of the things mentioned so we'll see <laughs> guys we're at Target with my mom uh-huh have a little uh, dilemma see I thought I'd go ahead and shop for some like things for my room and right now I have a hamper and some bedding and whatever and I've literally been holding it this entire time because I don't know where Renee is and he has the cart so that's what's happening right now mom smell it <laughs> oh my god Oh god, I can't. Dang, you really didn't even let me like tell me beforehand. <laughs> that was supposed to be lavender. That it does smells. not smell like lavender. Okay. So we are back from Target and quickly I'm gonna show you guys what I got. So I went to go buy some more stuff for my room because still trying to get some more stuff for this bedroom transformation that is taking and I was actually gonna get a new bedding because I decided to go ahead and give my room a theme. So basically my theme is roses. As you guys know, or if you've been following me for a while, the rose is my favorite, favorite flower. That's why I changed my tattoo from its original design to roses to give it more of like the representation of me. Um, anyways, so it's now roses and quickly to show you guys, I added these roses on my mirror as like the little border and then I have some lights that are also tied with it. So I have these lights here 
and they're basically some stars but to let just show you guys what how they actually look they look like this and let me turn the light off real quick but that's how they look have these star lights makes them look like that cute right so have that going on sorry that was kind of like funky you know with the camera and tripod whatever anyway so yeah my theme is roses so I was gonna get this bedding that was red because um, I want to change the bedding as well get rid of this one and switch it up so the bedding that I was gonna get was red and then I was gonna get some white sheets and then a white bed skirt but I left the bedding because I was kind of going money crazy and I didn't really want to do that because I already did a big purchase with getting my new camera so I don't want to you know put my money down the drain that quickly so I ended up leaving the bedding and I went ahead and got myself a hamper a new one a black one to go with the theme and you know I, it was time to get a new one so I went ahead and got that I thought it was gonna fall. So this is what it looks like on the inside, you know, regular old hamper. And then I went ahead and got my dad a little sum. Got him a little Laker hat, cause you know he's crazy for the Lakers. And then after we left Target, I thought we were just coming home, but okay, so I should probably explain this to you guys. So for my new camera, it was actually a Christmas present sort of-ish for me. So basically as my Christmas present, my dad and my brother decided to go halves and help me out with buying this camera. But since I got paid today and I already had my dad share um, that was enough to get myself the camera so I ended up telling my brother not to give me that half and to just use it for something else because you know I didn't really need the money anymore so I ended up telling him to use it for what he needed and he decided that he would go ahead and get me some things that I've been needing for my camera so we ended up stopping at Best Buy and he went ahead and got me a tripod for my camera and this is actually one of like the flexible ones which is one that I've been looking for so got that and then he went ahead and got me a little camera bag this is a sony camera bag just a small one so my brother ended up helping me out with that so thank you so much to my brother and my dad because they came through <laughs> <laughs> so that's just a few little things that I got from the store today. I still want to go to Ulta and hopefully my mom is up for going over there. So they're currently with my dad who just got out of work. They want to go and eat something. So hopefully when she gets back, she'll want to go and take me. So let's hope. <laughs> Can I just appreciate how the sky has been looking lately? Like, oh my god. Also, while I was out, I had to go ahead and make a little quick stop because, you know, your girl needs that Starbucks. Surprisingly, I actually haven't had it in a long time, so it was time, guys. I got my Grande White Chocolate Mocha Frap, so heck yeah. Is this what it sounds like? No, okay. Panther. Excuse me, Panther. Excuse me, Panther. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, careful with the car. <laughs> oh, yay, yay. there <laughs> you're not watching the road <laughs> drunk driver sorry guys <laughs> oh <laughs> what <are you> doing? <laughs> it was yeah, ran over gima <laughs> technical difficulties <laughs> leaving the abiba behind <laughs> I almost died, but it's fine. <laughs> oh, stop, baby. I have Bebo here to help me. <laughs> Trying to see which is my tone. You need to buy your Hmm. I think it might be too yellow. Yeah, these ones might be. They have golden beige. Set now for the concealer. Oh! All thanks to Bebel because she was there to help me out. And then thanks to mom for being our little driver tonight. <laughs> so much was spent today, but I guarantee it's going to be worth it. And here we are again, but this time we are here with Ulta. So, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I got. 
So for starters, I went ahead and got me a little makeup box to store everything in because the little makeup pouch that I have isn't going to do it. So got this guy and basically got some teens for my little makeup stuff. I mean, whatever. What? Was that English? Okay. Scoot you guys up real quick. So for foundation, I went ahead and got the Too Faced Born This Way foundation in the shade Natural Beige. And the packaging looks like this. Cute. Whatever. Jumping on here really quick to say that if you guys caught me looking to the side multiple times, it's because I literally had my camera in front of my mirror. So I was able to see what was going on because don't have a freaking 180 screen so it's so difficult so just wanted to let you guys know that's why I kept looking to the side I was checking to see how everything was looking through my mirror so carry on also Bebo did go with me so she can go ahead and help me out with choosing these products because I don't know jack about it so I needed a second half so she was my little right hand for this makeup trip. Next, I went ahead and got for concealer was the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Full Wear Concealer, which is actually the one that Debbie uses, the one that I used from Debbie. But I went ahead and got the shade Cashmere, number 360. Looks like that. I thought I'd go ahead and do, you know, not go with what I've been using, but grab something that was more for my little shade complexion. Is that what they say? I don't know. But went in a shade lighter. And then, oh, and I got myself a beauty blender because I think I'm gonna need that one. This one is from Morphe. And um, yeah, it's basically it for that. Um, nothing too crazy about it. For the contour, I went ahead and went with e.l.f. This palette, which was actually the one that Bebo was using. So I went ahead and got that one to try out for myself, see how I like it, whatever. Then I went ahead and got a highlighter. This one is from Maybelline. It's the Master Chrome Metallic Highlighter. Let's see, what is it called? I don't think it has a name, does it? I don't know, but it's number 250. Looks like that. I don't know whatever okay so for like the setting powder um i went ahead and got the revolution makeup revolution london is that what it is i have no idea um but it is banana light it looks like this and bebo hasn't used it but she heard that it was pretty good so i decided to go ahead and try it and then let bebo know how it works if it's good or not i don't know whatever also went ahead and got myself a lash glue this was the duo lash glue and then to end it off, I went ahead and got myself a palette. I think this was a ColourPop palette. Yeah, this is the ColourPop palette. This is called Sweet Talk. Looks like that. And I think it had like peachy tones, if I'm not mistaken. I think that's what I saw when I opened it, but we're gonna go ahead and check. So this is how the palette looks without its package on. And then, oop, dropped the paper. So this is how it looks when it's open. I have the little ColourPop Sweet Talk here, and then our colors down here. It has some peachy, pinkish, orange, some like shimmeries. I thought I'd get that as like a start. Also, final thing that I got, I decided to save it for last because it was one that I was actually looking for for a while. Well, not for a while, obviously, but it was one that I really had in mind when I saw that it came out. So I went ahead and got the Frozen palette. This one is Elsa's and, oh, okay, gotta untie it, I guess. Fancy. Alrighty, so she looks like this. And then when we open it, ba-bam, you got all the good stuff in there. How freaking cute. So it looks like we have the palette, we have a lip gloss, a lipstick, if I'm not mistaken, and I guess a highlighter. Oh, it says it's a glitter gel. I don't know what that means, but anyways, we're gonna look inside. Oh, almost dropped that. So this is how the palette looks by itself. It's a small palette. And then we got our girl Elsa here. Have all the cute little designs. Have cute little color names in the back. I love that, honestly. Oh, and then it has Elsa's name on the top. That's cute. But anyways, when we open it, this is how she looks. Got our pretty colors here. So the one that actually catches my attention is Spindrift. Is that what it says? It's this guy here. 
This one caught my attention the first time that I saw the palette. That one and water. Those ones are like my go-tos that I saw. I think I'm gonna really like those, but the palette is cute overall. Oh my God, this is so cute. Okay, so that was the palette. Here we have our lip gloss, I'm guessing. It says Mythic Journey, looks like this. Sorry, I have like bad lighting, but whatever. But it has little snowflakes on the top here. I don't know if you guys can see that. It has little snowflakes, and then the bottom has the snowflakes as well. So I'm not really one for lip glosses, so I might not use this one. But I will try it out to see how it looks, I guess. But that's that. And then we have our lipstick, which looks like this. Again, has little snowflakes all around. I'm gonna open it up, and it's this cute color. So this is she. Ooh, she's rocking so well. So it's actually called little snow so that's cute i like the color actually i think i'll wear it and then this is our guy so it's like a glitter gel i don't know if it's supposed to be like an eyeshadow Ooh. oh so i guess it's just glitter yeah it's literally just glitter so that's fun leave that back in there packaging itself this is what it looks like and then we have the snowflake on the top so cute. This is really cute, honestly. I'm not gonna lie. Freaking love that. I still wanna get Anna's set as well. That was the one that I wanted to get first, and then I wanted to get Elsa, but we went backwards and got Elsa. So, so that is my little startup on the makeup stuff. I didn't get anything for brows because there weren't really good options. So there was one that was from Anastasia that I wanted to get, which is also one that Bebo uses, but of course they didn't have the color for my brows which is funny because literally on everything that I was getting they hardly had the one for my you know complexion or whatever you guys call it I don't know but they didn't have it for me so I had to kind of like work my way around through everything to get what I needed and um, so by the looks of it I guess you could say I got basically what I needed I'm really excited to try this guy <sighs> so funny guys my mom was telling me earlier that she's laughing because now i'm buying all this makeup stuff and i mean even you guys know like i'm not a makeup person i always told you guys that i was never crazy about you know full faces of makeup and i mean i still stand by that but I tolerate it for you guys because you guys want these makeup looks and I don't know now there's just moments where I'm just like okay I'll do my face but it's not something where I'm gonna you know do it every single day and like put it as part of my routine no at the end of the day I just went ahead and got this stuff to prepare myself for future makeup videos that you guys want so um yeah I there's a little side note for you guys this isn't you know for everyday routine this is for myself like whenever there's an occasion but majority of the time it is for you guys to bring out those makeup videos so i don't have to go and bug debbie for her makeup i'm probably only just gonna bug her for her eyebrow pomade because i don't have that so so i think i'm gonna go ahead and throw this stuff in there i keep looking back at this palette it's so cute and then i like how the palette is also like holographic in a way it makes it so cute what am i becoming oh my god i'm going from just eyeliner and lipstick to all this stuff i never imagined myself honestly like buying any more makeup things but like i said it's for you guys at the end of the day and you know i might use it occasionally for events but at the end of the day it's for you guys so don't even try to go there <laughs> legit though like the majority of my paycheck went to this no lie majority of my paycheck went to my camera and then whatever i had left went to the makeup because y'all know makeup is expensive as hell which is another reason why i don't want to get involved with makeup like that <laughs> but i guess it's too late because it's right here so that's great but yeah guys that is basically going to conclude today's video. I'm still shocked at myself for buying these makeup stuff, but whatever. Really excited to have finally bought the tripod. Well, I didn't buy it, but to have, to be given this tripod gifted, I guess I should say, because it was part of my 
Christmas gift in a way. I'm really glad I have this guy and a little camera bag. I am very, 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 very excited to have purchased my new camera. And I'm really excited for it to come in because huh, I'm just really excited because I was able to find a camera that has the 180 screen. So I'm gonna be using it a lot more because the main reason why I don't use this camera is because I can't see myself. And I always have to struggle with seeing what I'm doing, seeing if I'm in focus or, you know, all that stuff. So this camera, I pray, I hope that it's so much better. I hope that it works for me. I should be getting that in a few days. So as soon as I get it, you guys will know. But yeah, so thank you guys for watching this video. I really hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a big old thumbs up. I would really appreciate that. Comment down below what your New Year's resolutions are. I am very excited to hear about those. Don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to follow me. What? I forgot most of my outro, okay. Don't forget to follow me on social media to keep up with my not so entertaining life on my channel's life. I love each and every single one of you and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys.